pleasure to introduce to you a new friend and partner of, at work here at with MTV, Maya Anista, CEO of Mobilize.org, and one of uh, MTV's best in class partners. She will be, uh, she will join us in sharing some exciting mission serve partnerships, including the one that we launched for Mobilize.org today. Maya. And thank you to Service Nation for this tremendous event and for their commitment not only to my generation of veterans, but to all of the men and women who serve our country. It is my pleasure and tremendous honor to announce six innovative mission serve partnerships, beginning with my own. Mobilize.org, the Goldhurst Foundation, and MTV, with the generous support of the McCormick Foundation, are partnering to host a town hall exploring the unique issues facing our returning millennial veterans and providing seed funding to innovative veteran-led projects that address their needs. <laughs> this event will be held in the spring of next year in connection with the seventh anniversary of the Iraq War. We will build both online and offline programming around this convening and reach out to millennial veterans on our campuses and in our communities. Also, America Forward and Be the Change are joining forces to create a landscape analysis of where service opportunities and veterans programs intersect. And because Rob and Ross are not busy enough, Be the Change will also be working with Survivor Corps to ensure a robust civilian service component of the national strategy for healthy home homes. Now, since 2006, the St. Bernard Project has been building energy-efficient homes in areas devastated by Hurricane Katrina. Now, we're pleased to announce that a new partnership focusing on recruiting veterans to work as full-time employees on its build sites. JROTC and City Year are partnering in Boston through City Year City Heroes program that engages high schoolers in at least 100 hours of voluntary community service centered around City Heroes service days throughout the year. Now with this partnership, City Year is recruiting directly from the population of JROTC cadets and reserves a certain number of City Heroes slots for the cadets. Finally, Student Veterans of America and the Wounded Warrior Project are working together around the country to help wounded and injured veterans achieve a college education. Our deepest thank you to the 10 organizations that we mentioned here, the hundreds represented in the room, and the thousands working around the country for our veterans. Thank you. <laughs> 